I made a joke up top that you're here pushing this new show, Friends, and it almost feels in a way like that's a version of the truth because Friends is on Netflix now, and there's this whole other generation. Yeah. My daughter is watching Friends, and she didn't know what Friends was, and now she loves Friends. It feels like it just keeps going. Is it, you have that sense? It's awesome. <laughs> yeah, it's, it, it, it's, 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 it's kind of unbelievable, you know? It, it yeah. does every generation, like every year, there's like some new kids that discover it. And even, you know, for people that are not discovering it for the first time, it's like people have called it comfort food and things like that. It's, yeah. it's kind of nice, yeah. yeah. Do you ever find yourself in a situation like, I don't know, you're going through an airport or something and Friends is on and you look up at it and you absolutely have no idea what is going on in that episode because it's been so long since you did it? If you, if you checked in blindly on an average episode, would you say, oh, wow, I wonder what happens? <laughs> yeah, well, I'm gonna be 97 next year. <laughs> you know, you were, uh, of course, obviously that changed your life overnight, the success of that show, but you were broke when oh. you got friends, isn't that right? Like, seriously broke. Yeah, I, I, you know when you think, all right, I got a little money in the bank, I can, I can hold out till the next gig. I had, I think, I was down to $11. Wow. 11. $11. Now that's holding out too long. <laughs> really? Because even if I said at that point, all right, I'm gonna go get like a, like a waiter job. By the time that $11 ran out, it would have been before the first paycheck on that right, job. Right, I right, right. You out. waited too long. I would yeah. have starved. Yeah. Could you afford a headshot? Did you have a headshot at the time? Because that's the big thing in this town is you gotta have your headshot, a, a good picture of yourself. Yeah, a lot of yeah. times, People say that's the difference between getting a job or not getting a job. Yeah, I had uh, I had the same headshot for a long time. Yeah. yeah, the first the first headshot that I ever got taken. So I went to the photographer and he said to me, he goes, "All right, uh, we, you know, it's all set up. He's got the cameras and the lights and everything." And he says, um, "Before we take this, you might want to go and get that tooth filed." I go, well, "What are you talking about?" Yeah. He goes, "Yeah, one tooth is a little longer than the other one." I go, "Oh, really?" You should get that filed. I go, okay. Right. Yeah, yeah. And then come back. So I went and I, you know, back when this is back when there was phone booths. Yeah. And the yellow pages. Yeah. So I look up a dentist, no insurance. I go to see the guy. He says, Yeah, I can file that for you. It'd be about eighty bucks. I go, eighty bucks? What? Well, I go, what are you gonna do? He goes, I'll just file it. I go, let me see the file. <laughs> <laughs> so he shows it to me and I go, well, ah, forget it. No worry about it. So I go to the drugstore and buy like a three pack of emery boards. <laughs> Wait a minute, Five. you filed your own tooth down? Yeah. <laughs> Hold my you were, you were, yeah. Really? Yeah. I'm very frugal. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, when you went back to the guy, what did he say? The did guy, he goes, they, they did a nice job. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got a really good guy. Yeah, he's yeah. the best. <laughs> Thank God he didn't say you needed an eye job. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, that could have been. Yeah.